Hey everybody, it's Rachel O and I'm back with another great video. I really hope you enjoy it. I want to say welcome to all of my new subscribers and thank you to all of you who watch on a regular basis. I really appreciate your love, support, and of course, sharing this video with any friends that you think may be able to benefit from this information. So today I'm just going to do a really quick video, hopefully, about foundations that I love. Here in Chicago, the season is changing and it's fall. Before you know it, there will be snow on the ground. And as you know, you have to change your skincare and your makeup routine. And so I always, around this time of the year, go back to some of my favorites. But I also look for things that are new on the market. And I've been getting a lot of questions about BB cream. And I did actually do a post as a beauty contributor for the Carol's Daughter website. And if you guys just follow me on the blog, when that post is available, I'll share it. And you can read what my thoughts and opinions are on the BB cream. So let me first start off with the most expensive foundation that I found. And this is it right here. It's from Bobbi Brown. And um, it's called the Repair Foundation. It has an SPF of 25 and I've never paid as much as I paid for this foundation and I probably wouldn't have even purchased it if I didn't have a gift card because I normally do not spend this much. So it was $60, yes $60, but I am a busy mom and I love to use products that have multiple uses. So this is not only my foundation. It also serves as a moisturizer and of course it has an SPF and in addition to that it is packed with peptides and antioxidants and so I love to use products that have anti-aging benefits because I figure no I'm not older and maybe I'm not really in need of them as someone that has more mature skin but I like to protect and protect my skin and so I want to show you all a little sample of it it's very very rich and creamy I'll put a little bit here on my skin so you can see um, what the texture is like it kind of leaves my skin with a like a dewy feel to it but if it looks um, a little too dewy all you have to do is put a little bit of powder on it and you still your skin will your skin will still get the benefits of it so it's called extra repair and it's SPF 25 Bobbi Brown then I have um, one of the products that I actually sell at the salon that I work at as the lead makeup artist. And it's a foundation and concealer quad. I love to use this on my clients and myself because you get four shades. And again, sometimes it can be a hassle if you've got concealer and foundation that you have to put on. This has everything in it. It's a custom color palette for you and you can only get these at the salon that I work at. I'll post a link so if you're interested in getting it it's available. It's wonderful. Um, now if you're a drugstore shopper this is by CoverGirl and it's from the Queen Collection and this foundation I really like because it is a moisturizing makeup. In addition to that it's a liquid makeup. So of course with liquid makeups I'll put a little bit on my hand you know that the texture is very very lightweight and perfect for someone that doesn't really like um, to wear a lot of makeup because it's it's liquid so it's very lightweight but it'll still give you lots of great coverage and I one thing I do like about the Queen collection is that they have a lot of wide variety of foundation colors there's nothing worse than going into a store and seeing that they only have shades that are very limited for African Americans so Check out the Queen Collection if you're a drugstore kind of girl. Also at the drugstore, L'Oreal True Match. This is a great foundation too. It, it also is a liquid. It's very lightweight. Again, I found that the colors are very, they have a very wide spectrum of colors. This I love because it has a very yellow olive undertone. And so if you go into the drugstore, check out True Match too. And last but not least, this is one of my favorites. Um, I love foundation sticks. This particular one is from Fashion Fair. And of course, you got to love a foundation stick because it's portable. You can drop it in your purse. You swipe it on. 
This one is a little bit darker. Um, but you just swipe it on and it's very easy to use and because it's a cream, it gives you lots of really great coverage. So when you're looking for your foundation in this colder, cool climate, just kind of think about what your lifestyle is like. Are you busy or on the go? Or are you the type of person that likes to spend a little bit more time putting on your makeup? But I personally love to have options. So that's why I have, you know, a really nice creamy foundation. Then I have a lightweight foundation. It just kind of depends on what kind of mood I'm in and what my skin is looking like. So I'll be back next week with some more tips for you. And thank you guys for watching the video. If you'd like to learn more, you can always catch me at www.rachelobeauty.com. I'll see you guys again next week. Peace. Thank you.